So many hotel doors swing in when all it would take to make this entire bathroom and this whole hotel accessible is to swing the door out. There's lots of room in the foyer to swing the door completely out and still be able to get around it. But that's not the case. So we come in this way. So what is our goal? Our here? goal is to project myself from here behind the door into the tub because sometimes you just don't have an option. So it's kind of accessible. Like I can get onto the toilet if, if people are able to do that front side transfer, which you know, put your feet over here. We'll pull it up. Oh, and they're slippery. It's messy. But do the front side transfer. Then we push the chair out of the way. And there's times where this room slopes the wrong way, so you'd have to get somebody to get it for you if it was con to continue. But here would be step one. If you want to actually use the toilet, this is it. Kind of got some privacy. You can still see everybody out there holler if you need a hand. We'll use this bottom of the tub thing for the feet on the outside of the tub, just to make it a little safer than normal. <laughs> With pants on, this toilet seat's a little slick. That's okay. So we go like this. And we have a towel here folded multiple times so that when you transfer over the tub ledge, it's not so hard on your butt. Oh, and the shower is kind of wet. So we're going to, you got two towels in here? Yeah. I'll take this one, fold it up. Put her down. wherever. Oh, this is nice. Most hotels don't always have this big lip, so you can actually sit on the side of this fairly nicely. It does constantly slope into the tub, so we'll just be mindful of that with the transfer. And here's the thing, we hold on to the public toilet seat with a whole hand, so hopefully it's clean. And we transfer. And then so I was saying earlier, sometimes you just do things where it makes it easier so that and safer. So this is how I would do this. <laughs> Put my hand in the tub. And slide my butt into it. So that now this way, oh, there we go. Towel. Dryness, because it's damp and I'm in pants. Move that over. And do the butt shuffle and feet into the tub. We're in. <laughs> um, yeah, it's a regular shower. Oh, look, it has a handle. That's nice. So I can still pick myself up out of the tub, but I'm still able to have a bath in here, wash my hair, and do what I have to do. And not need a fully accessible room if this is all you got. And you want me to get out of the tub. Yeah. Here we out. go. So this is easier when you're wet because you stick to things like this. You can't be too wet because it's super slick, but you know, uh, pants don't make it super easy. Oh, and that may be from my, my fingernail. Is that from my fingernail or is that from somebody else? Who knows? So back the other way. And we will. Let's put this up here so I stick. 
and I will put this so my feet stick. Having a little bit of a sticky bottom on your tub is decent because it helps with where you plant your feet. Two out. My feet are sticking to the floor because they're a little damp from the bottom of the tub. This is what happens inside when everybody else is outside and they're like, you fine? Yeah, I'm good. I just got to get there. And then we put your feet on the other side of the door. And then you open the door, and you put your shit back inside, make sure you lock the brakes. If my new wheelchair doesn't have brakes, this is going to be interesting when I try to do silly maneuvers like this. Right, put the feet in the right position. To the up and over. Bathroom 101.